Here is how I beat Gravin's Black Widow with only my fists and a shield. Here are the rules. I can only use my fists to deal damage. No armor besides the Weevil Shield. Trinkets are allowed. I must first attempt the boss and beat it under an hour and a half. I selected Mild Mode and Hoops as my character. Now that I am on a timer, I instantly, quickly and efficiently grabbed resources that would help me throughout the run. I then proceeded to whack a Weevil as I would need its meat to get a shield. I also grabbed some food on the way, then made my way to the research station which I researched plant fiber, rocks and sap. And then I made a Peblet Axe. Then I whacked this gnat for absolute Absolutely no reason. I then researched some grass planks and then killed some lawn mites to progress my little fist mutation. While I was making my pebble and hammer, this red ant looked to me a bit funny so I just decided to whack it in the head. I also grabbed some sap and then went back to punching some more lawn mites. Then I punched some more lawn mites off the faulty spacer wires, then activated the spacer to unlock the oak lab and burgle. I grabbed some acorn shells which I would need for the acorn shovel, researched it, and then got some grubs for their hide. With the weevil meat and the grub hide, I made a weevil shield, so I can at least block attacks now. I then ran into the red anthill to get the red anthill burgle chip, and then cheesed away to get into the upper yard without using a rock explosive. And then I rested for a bit, cooking off my rest of the weevil meat. Now it was time to go all the way up to the upper yard to go to the coffee machine to grab the power droplet. But I needed a dandelion tuft, so that's what I was gonna get, and then got greeted by a red fire ant, and then finally got two dandelion tufts. Making my way up the Java Matic now, the dandelion tuft to these vines here to eventually get the power droplet over on these bricks here. Now it was time to get to Burgle at the Oak Hill Lab and then got greeted by a few mosquitoes on the way, which chased me for far too long. Running into the Oak Hill Lab, I decided to take all the sap they had so I could use that for fiber bandages, and then picked up Burgle. Now, as Burgle was talking, I got some more fiber bandages and granola bars, and then purchased the fiber bandage efficiency upgrade. Then I went to go and get my little fist mutation unlocked by killing far too many red worker ants. Then went to the four leaf clover to get the coup de gras mutation. I then made my way through the hedge to go up to the upper yard to fight the Black Widow, using these grass here as a stepping stone on my way up. Now I was trying to find a way to get the Black Widow out of her cave without getting the little ones out. So I started throwing some rocks, hitting the spider web. That didn't work either. But I ran at her and the fight was on. While fighting her, I got the Parry Master mutation. Now I'm a bit surprised that her little babies haven't come out yet and uh, somehow haven't attacked. And as I said that, I see two little baby widowlings coming after me. And for some reason, the Black Widow was like, yeah, the baby's got it. So I took good work of them. Coming back for round two, her final defenses came out, which uh, sadly poisoned me, but that was all right. After fish, him off with a critical hit, it was time for the one-on-one -on -one fight. Gave her a tap on the bum and she was ready. The fight is on and I have pretty good perfect blocking skills so it was quite an easy challenge. Thankfully I didn't get poisoned at all during the fight and I spoke too soon. Midway during the fight, I maxed out my parry master, so I never ran out of stamina now, which was always nice after perfect blocking. And then whack after whack after whack and after whack, she was finally dead. In my honest opinion, this was quite easy, and I finished it in an hour and two minutes and 32 seconds, which isn't bad. So if you guys want me to see this do in woe mode, if this video hits 50 likes, I will do it. But thank you for sticking around and watching my content. I'll catch you tomorrow, and if not tomorrow, the next day, and if not the next day, then any other day of the week. Have a good one.